So, hello everybody, the rumors were true and here it is, the Microwave 1 incarnation as a plugin from Waldorf. And luckily I was a little bit involved in the beta process so I could do some testing and ensure that it works, that it's also working nicely with Bitwig. And since I'm not really in a testing business of software or hardware, I thought why not make a song completely only with the microwave plug in and yeah that's what i did and we have a little bit of a walk through it yeah and here is the plug in itself as you see i put lots of incarnations on it so all of the different tracks hosting one of the microwave one plugins and i really like the interface it's also done by axel hartmann who did also the original microwave design and this looks really nice and it's really usable everything is laid out pretty simple so you have the two oscillators the filter the wavetable settings and here you see also filter envelope on this main screen then you have more details for the two oscillators more info for the filter section the global settings you can also change the tuning as well as the multi which we will look a little bit later on as well and then you have more detailed settings for wave filter volume envelopes and lfos as well and this is basically the same deal as the original one it's really a clone of it a software clone and you can even control the real hardware so there is an option to enable a media output and you can control from this nice plugin the real hardware and create the same sounds with this user interface. So since it's really the same deal as the original, there's not that much to say about it. You can also import existing libraries, so you can either import system exclusive files or MIDI files as well. One of the drawbacks I noticed that there is no category management at the moment. That's my absolutely number one wish to get some categories because you know there's a plethora of sounds in there, all the different factory sounds which are already part of there. Also on the internet, you find lots of microwave one sounds, and then it's a bit hard to find what you're looking for in these long lists. But nevertheless, it sounds great. It sounds like the original. So yeah, let's have a listen. I couldn't find some drums, so I simply created my own one. So I created a little bass drum sound here and a snare sound, heavy snare sound. But I added here some compression, a UE press track, as well as some reverb. And I have a little bit of a hi hat. And a really weird crash symbol. <laughs> which is the best I could get out of the device, but it's it's I like it. And we have the full drums. Already we are in an back into the 90s. It's it's a sound. And the, the bass are preset sounds. I layer two and the bass is really insane. I don't know how it sounds over YouTube, but here on my speakers the bass is insane. Lots of low end. And this is another sound I did on my own, which is a little F really weird and I also did here some some LFO modulation via Bitwig modulator so also sure with every VSC you can still use Bitwig modulator so I'm <laughs> modulating a bit here the hell out of it and it sounds pretty insane and yeah but I mixed it down already to audio because I did some copying and changing here to that one and sure we need bells so there's also some nice bells where are they here we had this melody with them and the second bell so it's a bit thicker and we we have some really lush strings and that's already it so straight 90s vibes, <laughs> which I love a lot. 
Okay, let's have a quick look also on this multi-mode. What can you do with the multi-mode? Um, I think it's not that necessary for the plugin if you use it in the door, because you can, as I did here, create lots of instances. But this is interesting if you want to control the external hardware, really, that it's much nicer here to edit then on the hardware. And you can add here then the number of different sounds you want to have up to eight and then you can configure the sounds you would like to have in there and do the transposition panorama volume so this is much nicer to set here than on the real hardware yeah so much for the quick overview i like it a lot and yeah have a look yourself and i hope you like it dig it and until next time make some funky music